So I've had a few questions around the 86 box emulator and it's stuttering with Windows 98 files. Now it does do that on some games unfortunately and I'm not sure how you stop it from doing that. Uh, if you do know, please comment below because I'd find that interesting as well to stop it doing it. But there is another alternative using a PCM build that is on archive.org. So what you need to do is if you go to archive.org and search for the PCM Voodoo 3000 file now obviously you've got to make sure you own Windows 98, which I do, I've got lots of copies of it, so you can just, it's fine, you can install that. So if you click on that, it's a pre-set up version of a, a, a PC emulator using Windows 98 with a 3DFX card on it. So if you just download that file, once you've downloaded it, if you unzip it and to a location, wherever you want to, and install it, well not install it, just unzip it, then so that's my version so then you can basically click on the PCM application once you've unzipped it the one thing you will need to do is set up the location of the hard drive of to where you unzipped it unless you if you unzip it so basically click on the settings files there and select the hard drive tab and then just click on the button the browse button then search for wherever you've um, unzipped it to uh, and once you get into that folder I think it's called win 98 to see there's a folder called drives and then you will select the Windows click open and it will come up with the hardest parameters click OK and then you can see it is put that location so then you can click OK and then basically you, you do exactly like you do on 86 box for any game so you would press play to start it if you've got an iso file you can insert that into the um options at the top because you can load an image and things like that you've also got your sound and your video resolution and things like that as well to make it full screen obviously you can go into the settings and go to toggle front screen full screen to come out of full screen it's control alt and page down and that will bring you back out again the other thing as well is once you're in full screen your mouse is locked if you're in the the smaller screen like this and your mouse is locked within the emulation if you press control and page control and end sorry and that will release the mouse back out of emulation so they're just good things to know so you just click OK. And it brings up the Windows 98. So once you've put in a file into the CD ROM, you just go into my computer and install games that way. Uh, and it works a lot better than 86 boxes. The sound doesn't stutter. Some of them do stutter a bit, but not, not nowhere near as many as that do an 86 box. So that's just a quick setup video if you want to use PCM under Windows 98 and it's a pre-installed one so it saves you having to mess about. So I hope that's helpful to people and I shall speak to you again soon. Thank you.